Hello, boys and girls. My name is Miss Angela. I'm Aiden Long's Nana. So they wanted me to tell you a little bit about my chickens. I have chickens and they are so much fun. Let me see if I can turn my camera around. Can you hear them? Oh my goodness, listen to them. Can you see those chickens? This chicken, her name is Cindy. Cindy, can you say hello? Don't move, it's okay. And this one's name is Amber. See how pretty she is? Hey, baby. Hi, Amber. And then that one is Dolly. Oh, this is my favorite. Yeah, her name is Phoebe. And she talks all the time, don't you, Phoebe? Huh? Yeah, you talk all the time. Yeah. Oh, my goodness. See, listen to her. Yeah. Hey, Phoebes. Hey, baby. Yeah. And these are, those are called black sex link chickens. These white ones, these are roosters. Can you see those roosters? There they are. Can you see them? Those are called, uh, oh my goodness, can you crow? I'm trying to think of what they're called. Oh. It's just left. Oh, they're called white silkies. They're white. But you know what? If you were to take all their feathers off, their skin is black. Is that not funny? They're all white, but their skin is black. I know. Okay. So, that's some of my chickens. And well, you know what they're wanting me to do? They're wanting me to give them some scratch. I'm going to show you what the scratch looks like. Can you read my shirt? Oh no, it's backwards. Never mind. I can't figure out how to turn this thing around. Well, my shirt says chicks, chicks, chicks. We love chicks. So see, they know what's in this bucket. She's trying to peck in it. There's different things I give them. This has got, oh, don't peck it out of my hand. See, it's got all different kinds of seeds and corn, and they really like it. Come on, girls. Come on, guys. Let's go. Come on. Chick, 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 chickens. Come on, chick, chicks. Come on. And then I just toss it on the ground, and that's what they like. Here, chick, chicks. Come on. Hey, chick, cheese. There you go. See, they just like to eat it. Here you go, babies. And I do this about twice a day. But other than that, they eat worms and bugs. Do you know they're the best? We don't have ticks in our yard anymore because our chickens eat all the ticks. Isn't that a great thing? It is, isn't it? There's some more. There you go. There you go. They like sunflower seeds. See, that's got sunflower seeds in it. Can you see those chickens? Listen to them. Hear them pecking? Yeah, are you talking to them? I know. Ba -ba -ba. Yeah, I know. Oh, goodness. What good babies you are. Yeah. Look at him. His, his comb on top of his head is red. Can you see that? See? And his earlobes are like a bluish green. Can you see that? His earlobes are like a bluish green. They're pretty babies. Oh, somebody got mad at somebody. They do that too. They fuss over who's gonna get to eat first and who's gonna get to eat second. They're, they're, it's called a pecking order. And everybody has to stay in the pecking order. Somebody didn't get in it. Somebody got in trouble. So I'm gonna show you where they live. And I can't figure out why my phone won't let me turn it around. But we're gonna walk down to their chicken coop and I'll show you where they live. And maybe, just maybe, we'll get some eggs. I hope we do. So it's a little shabby looking, but it's old. It's, it's been here for about 
seven or eight years, but this, can you see it behind me? There it is. That is their chicken coop. See, they got a little door that I can go in and go inside. I don't usually go in too much, but they've got that, that coop. And these right here are the nest boxes. And I lift these up right here and hook them at the top and I can get in and get the eggs without having to go into the, into the house. This is the, the door, this is to their coop, the area that we have where I can lock them up if I need to. And see, can you see that's their little ramp that they walk up, my husband made that, and they've got their little door, and if I need them to be locked up in here, I just have to unlatch that and, and put the door down, see? And I can lock them in the house to make them, to get them, uh, so they'll be protected in case something's hanging out around here that might kill them. Because they have predators that might, like raccoons and uh, possum and skunks and things like that. And then my husband built me this neat feeder. Let me show you it. Where I can, see it's a PVC pipe. And I can lift this lid off of it and fill it up in there with their food. Not the scratch, it's some pellet food. See, like this? And then he put drilled holes in it so that they can eat out of these holes. Can you see the holes? There they are. And see, this is pellet food that we have to buy to give them, that gives them their nutrients that they need. And they eat out of this. So I just pour it in up there and it comes out down here. Isn't that pretty cool? And so if we're gone on vacation, I can fill it up, but usually I just put enough in there for the day. Oh, I can't get this song to do right. I'm so sorry. Oh, did you hear him? So, let's see. Let me just see if I... It's a mess in here. And you'll see the reason why you really don't want chickens to live in your house is because they don't use the bathroom in a litter, ba in a litter box. But do you see those... Can you see this board and this board and there's a rod on this side and a board here and there's two boards on the back and do you see the mess that they've made this these boards are what they roost on they roost at night they like to be up high so the chickens who are the the leaders of the group usually nest up on the top ones and the chickens who are lower on the pole nest down here. So what happens is they might get their heads pooped on. Uh-oh. But that's the that's their coop. That is a, a bee trap, a boar bee trap. Up, it's hanging up on the wall there, that thing, to catch boar bees. Because they put holes in the wood. So we're trying to catch them. But anyways, they even have a light. That's not, it comes on, it's on a timer. And it comes on every evening for them. And they have it stays on till about midnight. Okay. Let's see. What else? Uh-oh. I dropped my basket. Look here. I have a chicken basket. See my chicken basket? That I come down here and I gather eggs. So let's see. And I always hope that when I lift this lid there's not gonna be a snake. So we'll see, because I have lifted the lid and you know what snakes like? Eggs, they like eggs. I love eggs too, but if the snake's in there, I'll just let them have the eggs. So let's see what we can see and pray there's not an egg. I mean, uh, <laughs> pray there's not a snake. Oh, look. We're in luck. Can you see that? There are four eggs in that nest. Four eggs. So that means four of my chickens each had an egg today. Can you see them? There they are. Let's get them out and I'll put them in my basket. Okay, let's get these two out. See? See the eggs? And we'll put them. There's four eggs in my basket. 
I hope y'all don't get dizzy from watching this video because I've got it turned wrong. <laughs> I can't figure this out. Okay, so here's two more boxes we have to look in and make sure there's not a snake. There's not. And guess what? We have... How many do you see in there? Can you count them? How many eggs do you see? See if you can count them. I see one, two, three, four. We have four more eggs today. Okay, let me get those out. We'll get those out. There's two. And then there's two more that I'll get. Okay. There we go. And let me shut my door back. I have to unlatch it. And latch it back down here. So that they'll be safe. And now. Looky there. We got eggs. Thank you, Amber. Thank you for my eggs. Yes. Now look. These chickens. We've got our garden plowed up and they're loving it. They scratch in dirt all day long. That's what they love to do. But you know what else? I wish one of them would do it, but there's not right now. There's just a pecking and a eating right now. But you know what they like to do? Let me get over here. There we go. They, they like to take their baths in dirt. They take a dirt bath every day. Wouldn't that be funny? What if your mother or your daddy came to you of the evening and said, okay, it's time to take your dirt bath. What would you think? A dirt bath? Oh my goodness. <gasps> really? Would you go out and roll in the dirt? That's what they do. They get down in the dirt and they roll in the dirt and they lay over on their sides and kick dirt up on their feathers and and you know why they do it? The reason why they do it is because chickens naturally get things that are, are like mites and bugs and things like that that'll get on them. So they take a dirt bath to keep the bugs away. It's pretty neat, isn't it? I never would have thought, but it does. They take a dust bath. That's what it's called is a dust bath. And they get all dusty and dirty, but it keeps the bugs off of them. So God just planned it that way. They're so amazing. And you know, we can eat these eggs. These eggs are, uh, do you eat eggs in the morning? Do you eat scrambled eggs or fried eggs? Eggs and bacon, that's good stuff, isn't it? So, and we can make cake using eggs. We use egg cakes, eggs to make cake and to make cookies and to make bread. <gasps> we can use eggs for a lot of things. We cook with them all the time. Do you know some ice cream recipes have eggs in them? Uh, they do. The, a lot of things are made with eggs. They're so good for us too. They're very nutritional, high in protein. So eggs are good for us. So that's all about my girls. And I just love them. They're my favorite, but I don't want them living in the house, but I do love them outside. They keep me company in the summer and in the winter because I have to feed them every day, even in the winter time. We have to give them plenty of water. They require a lot of water. So even in the winter, you have to go out every day and take care of your chickens. It's all, it's every day. You don't get a day off, but I love it. And you know what? They make me breakfast. <laughs> They're good babies. I hope you enjoyed that. And maybe we can do another video sometime about bees because we have four beehives here. So maybe we can talk to you about bees. Did you hear that one crow? <gasps> he did. Thank you for letting me talk to you. Bye.